Greetings, this is Edward of Jumbo. In this tutorial, JavaScript arrays will be used. This is brought to you from the jumboshop.com learning JavaScript course. An array specifies a variable that can be indexed as a list in rows and columns. The first index is zero, as which is common in most programming languages. An array is also a data structure consisting of a collection of elements which are values or variables. As you can see here, uh, this we're going to split this in probably three parts for the arrays. So I'll keep it really simple. In this one, we'll just introduce uh, some array functions, which are right here. In the second part, we'll probably do associative arrays and multi-dimensional arrays uh, in the last uh, tutorial. So as you can see here, there's length, uh, which you can determine how many how many items are in the array. There's push, which appends, and shift, which inserts an item at the beginning. Shift removes the item at the beginning. Pop removes the item at the end. Merge, if you have two arrays, you can merge them together. Index of returns the position of array. So you might want to you can use this to see if something is inside an array which is similar to includes uh, includes will just tell you yes it's something does include but if you want to know the position the index of will help you with that and sort uh, you sort the array in alphabetical order and if you want in reverse order you use array dot reverse so let's begin okay so what I'll go here I'll create my array I'll call it even numbers and you can use square brackets for the arrays two four six eight and ten so that's my array and I can output it console.log even numbers then if I want to see how many items are inside that array I will say even numbers dot length so this will output the number of items Okay, so if if I want to remove the last item, oh sorry, if I want to access a specific item, for example, if I say numbers one, remember that's index. That's index. Really, uh, by index number, so it's really one is actually two. So it will be the second item, which should be four. And then, or if I say even, if I type in even numbers dot pop. So what this will do, this will remove the last item. Now if I console dot log even numbers, the last item will be removed. Then if I put even numbers dot push, 10 because remember 10 has been removed in the last uh, 10 was moved by pop so I add it back so this will add new item at the end okay so we can console.log even numbers then there's also even numbers dot shift remove this will remove the first item so remember the first item the first uh, sorry uh, once we're oh yeah even numbers even numbers the first one is two so this will remove so do not it's gonna start at four and then continue on to ten 
Then if I want to add something at the first position, I use Unshift. So add it back here. Okay, then I'm going to create another one called Even Numbers 2, and I'm going to put 12, 14, and 16. Now, if I want to merge them together, I say let combined equals even numbers dot con concat even numbers two. So this this will be a merge. Then simply console dot log combined. Hope you didn't make any mistakes. Let's see list. So I made a mistake at number 10 right here. Oops. There we go. Now it should work. Yes. <clears throat> here we go. You see uh, this, are the, it is, this is the output as just as described up here. Now if to get this course uh, you go to jumboshop.com and you go to the learning JavaScript course. The links will be in the desc description and you can get 20% off until the end of 2024. The other courses as you just saw. You can also go to, if you go to Amazon, amazon.com, you search for Edward or Jumbo. The links are also in the description. There will also be an article which I'll link to. Uh, you can get the Learning Python ebook. It's free if you're in Kindle Unlimited. There's a Learning PHP course. The Learning JavaScript course is going to be, uh, sorry, ebooks. I apologize, ebooks. The ebooks are here. The ebooks don't contain the Web IDE or, or the programming language themselves. And if you want some custom one on one, uh, tutorials online you go to jumboservices.com and we can cater to your needs you can call this number uh, in North America or this number anywhere in the world or you can go to the contact page the preferred method fill this in and get back to you within 24 hours thank you